Hello Newtonians. In this video, we are going to learn about the CAD file formats. We are going to look into the importance of CAD file formats, what native CAD file format is, and what are standard exchange formats. Importance of CAD file formats. File formats contain different information that helps your computer understand what to do with it. Information that is stored in the file will tell your computer which type of programs can open and work with that files. File formats, when they are opened in their native program, can be opened and edited by a native program or other programs that have the ability to read this type of format. The file name usually includes a file extension that indicates the format itself. For example, a document with the extension .docs indicated that this is an MS Word document in the XML-based format. In the same way, a CAD file has its own extension that tells a computer with which program it should be opened. In addition to helping your computer understand what to do with your file, CAD files are important because they ensure that all the relevant design and manufacturing data is properly stored. Imagine that you work 10 hours on your design and you save your progress in CAD file format that only saves every second feature you use, or that it is not capable of saving the dimensions on engineering drawings. It is extremely important that all of the relevant design and manufacturing data is properly stored in a file format of your choosing. Ensure design history and revision control. CAD files enable you to go back in your design and change if something needs to be changed. It would be an extreme waste of time that you must start from scratch every time you want to update something. Furthermore, you can see the previous revision you created in case you want to return to one of the previous iterations. It is also useful in cases when you want to see design history and changes that were made over time. CAD files improve the collaboration between different teams. In collaboration with PDM software, CAD files make it easy to exchange data between different team members. Furthermore, with the help of PDM software, team members will always have access to the latest and most up-to-date design files. CAD formats ensure compatibility between the different CAD software. Some CAD formats can be read by non-native software. In cases where this is not possible, we have standard exchange formats like .step that can be used to import design data from one CAD software to another. Native CAD file formats. Each CAD software typically uses its own file format to store and exchange data. These native file formats store the complete information of the CAD model, including geometry, dimensions, materials, assembly structure, and other design features. Native files allow users to fully edit and manipulate the design within the software that created them. Part CAD file formats are used to store relevant design and manufacturing data for parts, components, created in CAD software. The same logic is behind the assembly and drawing of CAD file formats. Standard exchange formats. Standardized file formats facilitate the exchange of CAD data between different software applications. We usually export or import these files into our CAD data, but they are not native CAD file formats. Let us look into some of the standard exchange formats that you may work with. Step file, standard for the exchange of product, is an international standard for the exchange of product data in a neutral and vendor neutral format. It is developed and maintained by the International Organization for Standardization, ISO, and the International Electrotechnical Commission, IEC. ISO 1033-242 specifies the application protocol for model-based 3D engineering. Step file format includes information regarding shape, 3D by default, design, manufacturing, quality assurance, testing, maintenance, etc. DXF file, drawing exchange format, contains 2D and 3D geometric and topological information, layer, line color, and text. EGAS file, initial graphics exchange specification, exchanges primarily shape, both geometric and topological, and non-shape data, referred to as CAD to CAD exchange. STL file, stereolithography or standard tessellation language, usually used for 3D printing. The STL format represents the surface geometry of a 3D object using a collection of triangular facets. PDF file, portable document format, preserves documents visual integrity and formatting across different devices and platforms. PDF files are widely used for sharing and distributing documents because they retain the original layout, fonts, images, and formatting, regardless of the software, hardware, or operating system being used to view them. Usually, you will export your drawings from a native file to a PDF file for easier sharing with other people. 3D PDF file, 
3D portable document format enables inclusion of interactive 3D models with a PDF document. This format is useful for design communication with people that do not have access to the CAD viewer software. CAD file formats ensure that our design and manufacturing data are safely stored. We are going to communicate with multiple teams and people, and we will have to exchange files with them. CAD software has the option to convert native data to non-native data. Usually, it is called export, or we can use the save as option to save the data in a desired format. For example, we can convert native drawing files to PDF format, or native part file to step file. These are all neutral files that can be opened with many standard available software. One of the things that I always suggest is that as soon as you start working in CAD software, enable the autosave option. Furthermore, when you start a new design, immediately save the file so that your progress is saved in case of a software crash or power shortage. Did you learn anything new in this video? Let us know in the comments below. Do you like our videos? Then, give us a thumb up, comment, and share it with your friends, colleagues, and on your social media channels. And if you want to become a part of the Newtonians, make sure to subscribe to our channel.